Good morning. So, because there are many new servers opening these days and I got many questions about what sets you could use, should use on your characters, I'm going to make a video about this today. This is like some, I don't know, some alt account that I made for fun some months ago. Um, but I can showcase the level 60 sets here better than on others. Uh, so let's get right into it. I'm going to start off with the priests and then in the end about the DPS. So first for dodge priest, let us go into the rankings. So Yeah, so the dodge set is called Nightfall Shadow and you can just see this name and recognize it that it gives you dodge rate and in the set it gives in the end 3% dodge, 3% dodge. If we upgrade it, uh, then you will just get more dodge and this is for all the sets. So, then let's next go to the priest sets that I would recommend. Because I do not recommend to go dodge at all, I recommend to go block. So I'm going to showcase the block set, which is the Unwavering Oath. It gives block chance, healing done, and in the set effect also block chance and healing done. It's called Unwavering Oath, and you can recognize it that it gives in the set block chance 8%, 10% healing done, and block chance healing done on the general things. Um, I'm not sure if there's anyone using block. I don't know why, but so good, this person is using block, amazing. Creed of Glory, it's called after level 80. And vows of valor. I would recommend you guys to play block priest if you play priest. In my opinion, it's more fun for PVE because it's much more easy. And I also prefer this effects on the dodge priest, uh, on the block priest, and I prefer to build a block priest. Yeah. You can also get the weapon for dodge uh, for block like this. Um, if you're playing a dodge priest, I would uh, not recommend to take a block weapon. You know, you need to take the dodge weapon because dodge weapon gives amazing amounts of dodge um, and talisman and gloves. There is nothing on dodge, so you will have to take this other one. Now for the DPS. DPS has the set Eternal Storm. If your equipment is called Eternal Storm and gives crit damage 10% on the set effects, then you got the correct one. It gives crit rate, crit damage, and the beginning crit rate. Um, let's see if we can get some higher DPS so I can show you guys as well how it looks. Eternal Hurricane, it's called later, but you just recognize it on the set effect, 10% damage, 10% uh, crit damage. As you see, it also gives Ignore Defense. Um, ignore Defense crit rate, and on the glove you get the crit damage, that's what I meant. You get the crit damage glove, and you of course get the crit Right, and ignore defense weapon, and as well as the crit, and ignore defense talisman. You're gonna recognize them when you drop them for crit rate. Uh, I'm gonna check if we can quickly see how they are called on level 60, but I doubt. Yeah, that's not the correct one. 
that's not a correct one. Let's quickly see if we can see a person who quit the game. But it was pretty decent for their BR. Maybe this one. Is already upgraded. Ah, so this is called Medal of Dawn. It's probably the correct one. And okay, level 70 is called Celestial Judgment. And this is the Blood Fang. But you will recognize it from the stats it gives. Um, let's just get about this. Death Fang. It's called Death Fang. And the weapon. Everyone knows up their weapon, right? <laughs> That's wrong. That's the one for Dodge. Spectre of Destruction. Oh, yeah, right. It was called Apocalypse. So that's the crater weapon. So that should be everything you need to know about the sets. Um, I hope this helped you guys and have a good day.